What's up everybody? Welcome to Google Foods. Today I'm going to show you how to make pizza dough. And we're already eating it, but I'm going to show you how I did it. Check it out. So I'm going to give you a pretty big advice. If you want your pizza dough to be perfect every single time, get a scale and a very precise one. We're going to be measuring everything by grams. That way you know it'll come out perfect every single time. Here are all the ingredients we're going to need. We got a thousand grams of flour, 550 grams of lukewarm water, six grams of dry east and east, four grams of granulated sugar, 16 grams of salt, 10 grams of olive oil, 35 grams of Italian dressing. So it doesn't get too confusing for exact amount, just look on the description below. So here's the deal. Some people tell you that you should mix little by little first to dry and then after you can put all the wets. No, not at all. With this recipe, I've done it a thousand times. Just throw everything together directly inside of your mixer and just hit go and your recipe is done. So let's do it. I first use this mixing hook. Now just let it mix. Now once the dough starts getting really sticky and uh, your mixer is starting to have a little trouble, it's time to change to the dough hook. See right about now it's having a little trouble, it's time to change to the dough hook. Now put it in low and let it mix until there is nothing else sticking to the sides. Now we got our dough here, a little bit of olive oil, cold another pan because we're going to let it rest so that it can rise. Cover it with plastic film and let it rest about two hours or until you double its size. Now it's time to make individual balls so that it's easier to roll out and make a pizza out of it. I like to make for my small individual pizzas about 140 grams each ball. So let's do it. I'm gonna let them rest, but you don't want them to dry, so I'm putting a little bit of olive oil so they rise nicely. It's time for the party. I'm going to be making some cheese pizza for my kids today. So let's do it. Hey, Dylan, make your own pizza, bro. This is what's good about these guys. 
Can't have the kids have a lot of fun. Oh, that's a lot of sauce. That's enough, dude. That's a lot of sauce, dude. <laughs> that's okay. Here you go. Here, spread it all out. Okay. There you go. Cheese makes everything better, right? You like a lot of cheese or you like a little bit of cheese? A little bit. All right, how does that pizza look? Delicious. Looks good. Are you ready yeah. to chop it up? Yeah. Uh, let's try your amazing pizza. You can tell that it was cooked good because if you look at the bottom, see that? Come here, Dylan. You see that? Yeah. That's how you can tell if it was cooked good. So this is looking good. Are you ready to try it? Yeah. Are you ready to try it, Dylan? Yeah. This is your pizza, my brother. All right. Now it's going to be very, very hot. It's hot? Mm-hmm. How it's is good. it? It's amazing. Is it hot? Yeah. Too hot? It's amazing. <laughs> you like it? Yeah. What's better? Pizza or steak? Steak. What's better? Steak or picanha? Picanha. <laughs> you love picanha? Yeah. This is the picanha boy right here, guys. He loves some picanha. You agree? Yeah. How you like that pizza? Delicious. Delicious. This is my gymnast champion right here. Can you do a backflip? Yeah. Can you do a round off? Yeah. Can you do a double backflip? No. <laughs> you gotta practice on that. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more pizza, I have a tremendous amount of recipes to do with pizza. This is just the basic pizza dough. And if you like this video, hit the thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber, make sure you subscribe for future videos. I have some amazing content coming up on this channel. And I'll see you guys on the next one. And remember, if you're interested in anything I use, everything is in the description below. Thank you so much, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.